Welcome back everybody to another three Atari games. And first up is Tempest. Let's go ahead and start it. I'm pretty sure everybody knows what, what Tempest is. Oh crap, I already lost. <laughs> I mean, graphically it looks bad. It looks really bad, but they've made like other versions of it. It looks really nice. This one just, fuck. I think this one, did I die? Oh, I did, I did die. Oh crap. Okay, they're shooting at me now. This one in like, I think it was uh, Geometry Wars kind of remind me of the same thing. Fuck, I'm getting fucked up. So, I don't know, if I ever say, damn, how do, how do you take them off of that again? I think I'm already dead, right? Like, that's it. Damn, I don't know how to take them off of that. Oh my god, I already lost for reals. Let's go one more. Okay. I mean, I know back then, like, if you go, if you go by fast enough, you can take them off. But I don't know how to take them off in this one. Boom, past level one. Fuck, and I go right to the missiles. Shit. Oh, oh. oh my god, this is actually pretty. And like, once again, I just think my controller is finally fucked up. Oh my god, I didn't move. I think it's fucked up already, just because like, it's at a point where it's just, it's consistently like, every game just doesn't really function correctly. And I'm dead. Once, oh my god. Is that, <laughs> that's game. Alright, well. <laughs> It's just, it's just really, the controllers are really stuck and it's just pretty hard, I mean, to fucking move around and do shit, but anyways, let's go ahead and move on to the next game. Alright, so next up we have is the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. This one's out of my personal collection, so. This one and the next game are the last games for my personal collection. Okay. Okay. Oh, fuck. Yeah, even though. What the fuck? Am I stuck? Okay, there. Even though, like, in reality, I shouldn't have hit that. Um. The, yeah. See, it's like I'm not walking there, but <laughs> it's considered a a thing to block you. It's just fucking ridiculous. Damn, man. I like the little, like, how the girls scream. It's fucking ridiculous. So I don't know if this is, uh, you can beat this, or it's one of those games where it's like, you play until, like, uh, you just get points. I mean, my bad. I'm trying to focus in a way. I think it's just a point system game. I thought that number was, like, how many people I had left. I'm gonna assume that's how many lives I got left, or gas tanks, I guess, because it seems like it, this shit runs on fuel in a way. Yeah, they teleport, so you gotta... Fuck. Okay. Alright. Oh, look at that, right off the bat. Oh my god. So it's not ideal to just fucking rev your chainsaw at them. Okay. Oh, fuck it, shit. What the fuck? How am I supposed to- Oh man, you have to like really slow down. Son of a bitch. Oh my god. Okay. Bam! She didn't even try to dodge me. Come here, you fucking bitch. Oh. 
There you go, be. She was trying. She tried. She failed. And I thought, like, <laughs> Leatherface goes after anybody. I didn't think it was, like, only females. It seems like this game only <laughs> wanted to murder females. Fucking guy. And I just realized, you know, like, the girls have, like, uh, oh, except for this one. But they had, like, oh. She kicked me in the fucking head, and that beats me. That's wins. But if you notice, look, she has like a different tank top color than her uh, skirt and all that, right? So why couldn't Leatherface have a different color shirt? Like everything's blue. His chainsaw's blue. His shirt's blue. His pants blue. Everything's blue. <laughs> so that, that's kind of fucking weird. But anyways, let's go ahead and move on to the next game. All right, so next up we have is Tron. I think this was Tron Wars or uh, Disc Wars, but it's Tron. So let's go ahead and start it. Like I said, this is my last uh, um, private collection game. Oh, ah, damn. The game's not bad, it's just the controllers are weird. You have to go to the direction that you're running, and then that's where the disc is going to go towards. So, if you wanted to shoot this way, you have to start running that way. Because if you start running straight, then it's going to fucking shoot straight. And then you have to, like, tap it. If you double tap, it'll come right back to uh, the disc. Like that. Oh, crap. I just wanted to show you guys how I fucked up. Okay. Oh, is it just one life? Oh, shit. All right, let's run that back one more time. Let's run that back one more time. I did not know it was just... Oh, my God. Oh, crap. I'm already fucking up. So every time I wipe three out, like, I get an extra health bar or something? What does that do? Oh. Is it like a secret door? Shit. Aren't these my teammates? I'm guessing the disc war ones just doesn't matter. I know the life cycle ones. Yeah, those those your homies. You don't want to kill those guys. Okay. Obviously, I'm doing a lot better. Oh shit! I, oh damn! There's white ones. I know there's like the red, the orange, the green, and the blue. What are they? Like the ISOs ones, right? I don't know if shooting the sides or these things do anything in reality. I'm just shooting them. See, there goes the green ones. And damn. I love the bat. Oh, God damn. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay. Gotcha. Ooh, I don't know what these ones are. Oh, crap. Crap. Crap, stop following me. Oh, damn, I got de -rezzed. And then that's it? Yeah, 
It's, it is one. I mean, you get a lot of health. Every time you wipe a whole board, you get an extra, uh, I guess, uh, health, I guess, is what it is. So, I mean, it's not too hard, but it's actually not that bad. It's actually pretty fun. I liked it. But anyways, that was three Atari games. If you guys enjoyed that, please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. We are the dreamers of dreams. Thank you.